Hello everybody, Cambing here with a guide to constructing the Staff of Herding, which is needed to get into Wimshire, the secret level found in Diablo 3. You need to farm six items to construct the staff. The first is the Black Mushroom. Change quests to Act 1, Reign of the Black King. The Black Mushroom is found in various places of Act 1, but the easiest place to farm it is in Cathedral Level 1. Take the port to the Cathedral Garden, and then walk backwards from Leoric's Passage into Cathedral Level 1. If you're lucky, you'll find the black mushroom sitting in one of the rooms. If not, you'll need to reset the map by leaving the game and coming back. It may take quite a few resets until the mushrooms spawn. The second piece is Leoric Shinbone. Change quests to Act 1, The Imprisoned Angel, choose Begin Quest, and then Start. Take the port to Leoric's Manor, and then walk back through the manor. Pull out your favorite weed whacker, and make your way to the northeastern corner of the manor, which contains a fireplace. Normally, there's nothing in it, but if you're lucky, you'll find some logs which contain Leoric Shinbone. Again, if you don't find it, reset the map and try again. The third piece is a liquid rainbow. Change quest to Act 2, Betrayer of the Horadrum. Choose the Forgotten Ruins. Head to the Dalgor Oasis and follow the bottom of the map to a small, watery entrance. Normally in this alcove there's nothing, but rarely a vendor will appear that requires saving from some mobs. After killing them, he'll open up the mysterious cave. Within the cave, a mysterious chest sometimes spawns that contains the liquid rainbow. The fourth piece is the gibbering grimstone. Change quests to Act 3 Machines of War and choose the Destroy Ballistae quest. Take the port to the bridge of Corsic and clear the fields of slaughter. There will be one dungeon cave on the fields. If it is the Icefall Caves, reset and try again. If it's the Caverns of Frost, go ahead and clear it. Hopefully you'll find the rare elite Chiltara inside, whom will drop the Grimstone. Again, if you don't find her, you'll need to reset the map. The fifth piece is Ritz Bell. Unlike the other pieces, there's no randomness involved. From Act 2, go to the little girl vendor in the bazaar. You can pur purchase the bell from her for 100,000 gold. The final item is the plans for the staff themselves. Head to Act 4, Prime Evils. There you will need to work your way up to and kill the mini-boss, Izual. Rarely he will drop the plans. Of 
The staff you can create initially only works on normal difficulty. For a staff that works for hard or nightmare, head back to Act 4. The Quartermaster will sell plans for the variant of the staff based on the current difficulty of the game. Finally, putting all this back together, head back to Act 1. Here I'll go ahead and make the staff first. And then head back to the first field of the game via the old ruins portal. The game is currently on hell difficulty so these mobs take a little bit of time to kill. Head back here to this pit and you'll find a cow skeleton. Normally nothing happens, but if you have the Staff of Herding appropriate for the game's current difficulty, the Ghost of the Cow King will spawn and once hailed will open up the portal to Wimshire. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'll be posting a Nightmare Level Wimshire run shortly. Thanks.